everybody this is Tiffany with Nittany's Craft and I'm here today to share with you a project that I did um, it is happy mail and it is for a YouTube crafter um, and her name is Ebony with sharing more and I just wanted to send her some goodies and I love her YouTube channel. She is an awesome crafter. Um, very sweet. Um, we message back and forth. Um, you know, through our videos and stuff like that. But she's very sweet and very supportive to my channel. And um, I wanted to send her some happy mail. So I'm making this video. But... I'm not going to upload it until I know that she has it, but I wanted to go ahead and make this video because I know me, I'll forget. I'll, I'll package everything up and before you know it, oops, didn't make one. Um, but anyway, I'm going to go ahead and share with you some items that I made and yeah, let's get started. And I'm one handing it because once again my desk is a mess but anyway let's get started um i made a and yes there is a terrible glare oh my goodness sorry so sorry about that but anyway um i made a loaded envelope and i got this particular loaded envelope idea, y'all can see it, from my number one, number one YouTube crafter, Tamika with Scrap the World. Um, she just did a video the other day on this envelope. You just take a 12 by 12 um, sheet of cardstock and you fold it in half. And you fold it up to make one pocket, and then here's the other pocket. So, um, like I said, if y'all go over to her channel, she just did the video, I think this past weekend. So, it shouldn't be hard to find. But anyway, I made this loaded envelope, and I've got some goodies in here. wanted y'all to see it while... Everything's in there. And I don't have anything on the back. Everything is falling out. But anyway, let me take everything out so y'all can see what I got. Right here, I just made her a little sequence. A little little uh, pocket or a little bag. And let me show y'all the paper pad that I actually used. I um I love this paper pad. I didn't know I loved it so much. It is so pretty. I'm sorry about that glare. And it's by DCWV and I got it from um Tuesday morning. I'm sorry, that glare. But there's the number. Y'all can see that. That's the number. But anyway, I love, love, love this paper pad. It is so pretty. And there's a lot of foiling in it. But, I mean, I just love it. I did another Happy Mail and I for uh, Lisa Goss on YouTube. And I use this paper pad as well. I think with Lisa, I may have used like the green. But anyway, I just wanted to share that with y'all. And uh, y'all have to forgive me. I'm, I am set up a little station on my bed to, be, to video this. But anyway, let's keep it moving. Like I said, I made her a little sequence bag with all the little colors in it. And you get these little bags at the Dollar Tree. And here's a little goodie bag with some little uh, 
gems, the little uh, charms, the tassels, and the little pom-poms. And there's some iridescent um, little sticky, sticky dots, I guess is what you call them. So that's what's in that. And then here we've got some little adhesive gems. And I got these from Joanne. And then I, I sealed them up. But if you look at my last haul video, I show you what kind of stickers. Well, hold on one second. Let me see. Let me see if I can. Hold on one second, y'all. Okay, sorry about that, y'all. I was trying to show y'all what's in this bag. Here's those little little stickers that I got at Tuesday morning. And they're in my last haul video. So I gifted some of those that's in this bag with the gems. And then this is in one of my haul videos as well. It's just a measuring spoon. It's it's like like rubber. Well, silicone. It says it on here. Four in one silicone measuring spoon. And it has all the measurements. I don't know if you can see that. But anyway, I thought that was cute. So I put one of those in there. And then here is some feathers I gifted her. Um, I actually got these from Natasha's Scrapbook Corner. She's on Facebook and YouTube as well. She has a store, an online store, and she sells the most beautiful um, embellishments and, and uh, lace and pearls and all kind of stuff. But anyway, that's where I got these feathers from. And then um, here's a magnetic, uh, magnetic pouch. I can't talk. It's late at night. I'm sorry. But anyway, here's a magnetic pouch that you put on your refrigerator to hold. I Right now, I have my dry eraser in it. And you just put it on there, on your refrigerator. So I gifted that. And also, if you see the packaging, I'm sorry, y'all. And the different bows. And that's the Martha Stewart punch bow. And this bow... I believe I got it from AliExpress. And then I made her some bows. This is a We Are Memories Keeper bow. I got these little bows in a um, die cut swap. And there's the Martha Stewart and there's the AliExpress bow. And that's the packaging. And then that's the first pocket. And these um, roses are from I Am Roses. And then the trim is from Hobby Lobby. Okay, and then in the top pocket, oh goodness, if I can get it out. Hold on, y'all. This is one-handed. Hold up. Okay, here we go. I made her some little note envelopes, embellishments, and I'm trying to think. The die is, hold on, hold on. All right, y'all, I guess y'all say I am so unprepared. But anyway, here we go. It's the Sizzix die, and I've had this for a minute, um, so, but anyway, this is the Sizzix Thinlets die. And that's all the pieces. And I used that right here. So, but anyway, and I made her these little embellishment and note cards. And I doubled them up with the card stock. And put the little bows on there. And I got those bows from a swap as well. And then that's the packaging. And then I have some more stickers. 
from Dollar Tree. There's the bow. And then here's a little treat. <coughs> Excuse me. A little tea, uh, tea and some little tea cookies. And there's... Now that bow is... I believe it's a Sizzix die as well. So... And here's the complete pocket. Let me back up. Yeah, there we go. Y'all can see that. Like it's not clear, but and I just put some cardstock across there and put a little pearl and did the same thing down here. So that's what's in there. And also I have some other goodies. Here is a Kleenex tissue pouch that I actually make these for craft fairs and the tutorial that I used um, is stamp with Shaolin and Shaolin is, and here's the measurements, it's a tissue pouch and it's stamped with Shaolin. S-H-A-L-L-O-N on YouTube. And like I said, I sell these in craft shows. And it is um, reusable. I put Velcro. I think in her video, um, she didn't, I don't think she used Velcro. But anyway, I have Velcro here. So you can reuse it. And I feel, I thought I would give her that as a little gift. And then also, I'm gifting her some ribbon that I got at Hobby Lobby. And here's the packaging or decorated. I just decorated it. And then here are some coloring washi tapes. And I gave her two of them. I just stuck a little glue in there. To stick them together and I put some of that trim that I had on the uh, envelope with a little bow just to decorate it and then last here's some little um, favor boxes I got from Hobby Lobby and here's a little bow I put on there I didn't put the little tails on the bow I just thought maybe that looked cute, just leaving it like that and put a little rosebud. And then I made her a card. And it glare. It says hello. And that is a Sizzix die as well. And then on the inside, hold on, y'all. Take what I put in there out. And this is the inside. What is that? Oh. And I just took some of that same cardstock and then I matted it and just put a piece of plain white cardstock. And I didn't write on it. I actually wrote her a little note on this and just leave it in there. Because she, if she wants to, she can reuse this card. And it has the envelope as well. So that is all of it. Um, I just wanted to share that with y'all. And Ebony, I hope you like it. Um, and here's the box that I'm going to put it in. And I normally put little like sequins and what are these uh, pipe cleaners. I kind of like twist those up a little bit you know for decoration on top of everything once I put everything in the box so but anyway just wanted to share y'all that like the video comment or both subscribe if you haven't and thank y'all for watching bye bye